Hello and welcome to the first episode of Imagine Studio Unboxed, where we dive into the world of indoor network innovations. Today, we're starting with a crucial question. Why bring 5G indoors? After that, get ready for some exciting hands-on time as we showcase a series of hardware demonstrations. With today's unprecedented boom in traffic, indoor small cells are becoming more essential than ever. This traffic is expected to continue long into the future, and easy to install and cost-efficient solutions are essential for getting that 5G indoors. Indoors is an environment where we're spending 90% or more of our time, and we see in modern networks that at least 80% of traffic originates in those environments. This is one and a half to two times that of the current outdoor solution. Ericsson's answer to this is the radio dot system. It is market leading, supports the latest 5G use cases, and gives you a multi-gigabit indoor experience. These experiences enable CSPs and neutral hosts to monetize those indoor assets. This may be by providing coverage and capacity solutions into a range of venues and building types and increasing your ROI or facilitating new 5G use cases. For neutral hosts, we support a range of functions enabling multi-tenancy and network sharing, reducing the cost of those deployments. What's important to note here is that the majority of US commercial buildings still operate on traditional DAS solutions, but DAS struggles to facilitate the modern 5G use cases. Ericsson's answer to this is the radio dot system. Let's check it out. Hi, Sohil. Hi, Colin. So let me introduce you to some of our Ericsson's indoor network products. And particularly, we are going to focus towards Ericsson radio dot system. Now, as you mentioned that Ericsson Radio Dot is supporting or offering a superior alternative to DAS. Basically, it enables simpler and faster installation. It eliminates the passive intermodulation or PM issues, and it supports frequencies greater than 2.5 GHz. Now, as you already mentioned that because of this Ericsson's innovative approach, basically now you can have high performance and high capacity in indoor coverage with extremely low cost per bit and area compared to any other indoor solution. And it also utilizes small cell frequency reuse. It will do TX and RX diversity, as well as it will support 2x2 and 4x4 MIMOS. Now, as you can see here, that basically we have different radio dot models. Now, if you go from the left side, the smallest one that supports single band. And then you can have dual band, triple band. So for example, in the case of triple band, you can have one TDD and two FDD, or you can go all the way in the quad band where you have the four band support. So basically, let's say in the case of TDD, you can have, for example, band 41, or you can have CBRS or C band. Ultimately, all these radio dots are optimized for coverage and capacity deployment. So as you can see that you can have from 800 megabits per second all the way to three gigabit per second. And typically each radio dot can cover 500 square meter to 1200 square meter of the area. So that is what this Ericsson radio dot system offers. Now, basically, as you know, that it supports four by four MIMO, but in addition to that, it supports carrier aggregation, network slicing, precise positioning, as well as, as Colin mentioned, that neutral host management capabilities. One thing or the important aspect here is that all these radio dots are future proof. So what does that mean is that it supports 5G and beyond with no rip and replace requirement. That sounds like an awful lot of capacity and capability in a simple product. So how practical is it to mount and cable this? Okay, so it is very simple. So you can mount this radio dot system or this radio dots into different kind of surfaces. So that is starting from let's say hard ceiling, walls, rails, and pipes. And for different mounting surface, you have the different mounting brackets. So in this case, let's say for this particular radio dot, I have this type of mounting bracket, which can be available on the hard ceiling or the walls. And then what you do is simply mount it on that particular hard wall or the ceiling. So that is how it is easy to install this radio dot. Now, regarding the cabling, 
So as you can see that you have one port here, one ethernet port here. So what you can do that simply you can utilize the regular CAT 6A cable and then you can just plug it over the ethernet connection and that will power this dot. Now the thing is that basically with this just one port, it can enable both the signaling as well as the power. That's really interesting. So where does the other end of this cable go? So the other end goes to another Ericsson product that is called indoor radio unit or IRU. Now, as you can see here that based on the variant you are going to use, so you can have either eight radio dots or 16 radio dots connected to one IRU. Now, these IRUs are frequency and technology independent. That means you can configure it software, configure it via software for usage with 2G, 3G, 4G or 5G. And another thing is that as you can see that it is coming in compact 19 inch 1.5 unit casing so that basically you can mount it uh, on in the rack or on the wall based on your requirement. Wonderful. And this looks like it has a lot of coverage capability for good sized buildings. Do we have any options for the smaller enterprises? Yes, so for the smaller enterprises or offices, venues, stores, restaurants, for those kind of venues, we have another product called Indoor Fusion Unit. Now, the best part is that it is simple and easy to deploy solution for these small offices. And the thing is that it can connect, as you can see, that four dots to provide the coverage and capacity you need for your small enterprises. Now, the best thing about this indoor fusion unit is that it has the integrated IRU as well as the RAN compute and baseband. So basically, then you can have pre-cabled, pre-configured RAN compute and IRU in the single case so that you just need to provide the power and it is up and running. So the whole thing is that with the indoor fusion unit, you can have the full RAN feature parity as well. So that is the beauty of this particular product. And again, it is coming in the concise, let's say compact 19 inch 1.5 unit casing so that again, you can utilize the rack mount or basically the wall mount as and when it is required for your installation. Wow, wonderful, Sahil. So for the small buildings, we have a one box solution. Yes. And for the slightly larger buildings, we have a three box solution, exactly. which is the radio dots, the IRU, integrated radio unit, and the baseband's. Well, thank you, Sahil, uh, for providing us with that great overview. And thank you all for joining us in this episode. Stay tuned for our next episode on how the dots are accelerating enterprise operations. Mm -hmm.